That's the only one not getting fucking juice. We haven't started yet, right? Can you hear? Oh, you know why? Because your fucking headphones have a have a button. There's a mic there that's fucking you up. Because that's what's up with my other headphones. Can you hear right now or no? That's that's how my Sony headphones are. Ooh, you're playing Helena. Yeah, these freaking headphones suck. There's a reason mine cost 500 bucks, the ones that I had last time. This is fucked. So I'm gonna have to hold my shit like this. <laughs> Dude, okay, first of all, We're I want to give a shout out to Fuck This Company. <laughs> Hold on one second. Good song to it. Yeah, but you could, you could pull this out like halfway and find like a sweet spot maybe. Is it recording? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're live. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking cheap shit, man. This is why, this is why I give you guys all the cheap equipment. It does the same thing. <laughs> God damn it. And I'm fucking stuck here. Yo, 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 yo. Hey, Flo, I was going to tell you not to do that last time. Uh-oh. What the fuck, man? <laughs> what are you thinking? <laughs> I don't know why you thought that was okay. There's a bottle opener. Here. I, I wonder why I didn't get it, though. I can kind of now hear it. Yeah? Yeah. Is I it, mean, fuck it. it fuck it, it. It's like one in, one... Yeah, one in, one out. Um, it, it almost helps just your mind to have one, the one that doesn't work off your Yeah, head. yeah. no, that, that, that makes sense. Is that what you're doing right now? One in, one out? No, no. He, no. He just, it's just because mine's fucking corked. Yeah, that's what happens. Should we start it now? Yeah, we that should... a whole bunch of riff Yeah, we should start it because I feel like... Yeah. Fine. We'll do it live. Fuck it. We'll do it live. Well, I guess you could just... That was all gold right there. No, so shout out, out to... Shout out to this company, Edge, for fucking sucking ass from iHip. You have to hold the button on the headphones in order for it to work. I think... Fucking it, a nightmare. Probably just because of the, con- the converter, but still... Fuck them. Yeah. <laughs> so fuck you. I, I mean, you, you have to say fuck you to Sony and all the other companies that do the same thing. That's just. I, dude, that just doesn't you make just sense. You just didn't know. That's what you get for fifteen dollar headphones, I guess. Fucking right. <laughs> yeah, my but head- they look sick. My headphones. They look time. like Beats. Kill well, these ones. Now we're now we're in it. That mm-hmm. song, if it could be heard by anybody, that was by Helena, Hollerin. It's a singer that I play with sometimes. She's super awesome. She is. She is a a a local legend. A local ledge. Local ledge. Yeah. So how was Spike Ball, boys? It's very nice. I was. Who very, who was winning? Not me. Not today. I didn't do very well either, but it was still fun. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Very nice. Mm-hmm. So is there anything uh, interesting going on in the world of worlds that you guys would like to chat about? Well, there was a shark attack up the street the other day. Oh, really? there happened. was a shark attack. Literally right after our last, our first podcast. Yeah. I wonder if we had anything to do with it. No, didn't we talk about it on the first podcast? I don't think No, because it was last Thursday and the shark attack was on Saturday. Oh, wow. 13-year-old wow. kid, lobster diving, first day of lobster season. What? Just got, got bit. Mm, jokes on him. He was trying to eat a lobster. No, it was it was season. It was all it was fair game. He shouldn't have gotten bit. That's a major bummer. I mean, yeah, no, but I mean, if the sharks had a sense of humor, it's the circle of life. Yeah, the tax man came around. You know, tax man comes around. What happened to him? Did he? He's still alive. Yeah, he's he's gonna make it. He's cool. Um, I've insane. Yeah, bit him like in the ear, 
and the shoulder. In the ear. Mm-hmm. Like, it was going for his dome, I think. I, I think it thought that he was a seal because supposedly there was a seal um, just fucking with him right before, mm-hmm. swimming around him. <clears throat> Anyone from Arizona that's just, it's too dangerous out here, so stay at home. I also heard that two people, <laughs> two people died on the freeway that same day, though, too. So, well, yeah, that's bad vibes. People die on the yeah. freeway every day. That's California, so just don't, don't, don't come to California. Just stay <laughs> off the road. <laughs> stay off the it's road. Too dangerous. The sharks way to get water. here is terrible. <laughs> yeah. There's sharks, dude. Bad drivers. On on a real note, I love how uh, how people love to make fun of California for having like a bum problem, but it's like. Every other state like sends their fucking bums to California. They'll like literally buy them a fucking bus ticket to that's, California. That's true. The the <laughs> the Canadians did the they, they do the same thing. They probably took after the Americans. We send them to BC to the coast. Really? Wow. Yeah. Send it's insane, dude. That's for, like for laughing much, at somebody for being dirty, but you just like threw a bunch threw, of dirt on them. You like threw <laughs> your fucking shit right at their face and you're like, dude, that's disgusting. <laughs> and you're like, like people want to talk about San Francisco and like, oh yeah, the liberals did all this. It's like, it's all you fucking Republican states that did all this. Oh, like, I, don't, I don't know about that now. I, don't know I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to say that. that Republicans are right or Democrats are right. They're both fucking idiots. I think it's just uh, it's a nice but place for bums to be. It's just a great place to be if you're a bum. And again, if you don't like bums, don't come to California. Well, check this out. I was in Laughlin, Nevada. I believe it was Laughlin. Because there was, it was casinos and there's a buffet, mm. right? And we got to this buffet like right as it was closing. And they were taking like trash bags. Oh, helicopters flying over. It's kind of chilly they, out here, isn't it? They were coming right over. You don't see that too much. It's usually like on the coast. That happened yesterday, too. Oh, there he is. Yeah. That's a police. That's a police, man. That's a ghetto bird right there. Oh, no. I think that's a life flight one. Oh, it is. Yeah, because the. It has ICU a medical right thing there. on the side. Remember, we were driving that one day, and we're like, holy shit, that helicopter yeah, is low. One time I saw the helicopter land right at moonlight. So we're just, we're right up the street if you've ever been to California or San Diego or Encinitas. If you've ever been here. If you've ever been here, we're on a coastal spot, but uh, a helicopter just landed the other day. Actually, it's been like a helicopter landing twice in the past two months. One for that shark attack kid and another one for... Some other idiot. A shark attack himself. kid. Shark attack kid. Poor guy. That yeah. sucks. 13 years old. That sucks. Because he's going to... Well, he might not be. Do you think he'll be afraid of the water? No, he already mm. said that he's ready to get back in. He thinks that the odds of... <laughs> he's like, that bitch-ass shark. That wasn't even that getting bad. Getting bit twice or... Good for him. Pretty low. And he's right. And he yeah, is. good for him. Yeah. That's crazy. Um. Oh, yes. Yeah. We were talking about being a bum and where you live and blah, blah. I was in Laughlin. Mm-hmm. Um, and they were, they were taking these... Freaking full on trash bags and scooping like cheesecakes, chicken, whatever it was, like all of their stuff, and just like s- sealing it up. This is where? Uh, at a buffet in Laughlin. Oh, wow. Yeah, and I was like, it, it, I was young, but I was like, man, if I'm ever in a place where I'm homeless or I need food, I would just like camp out behind the buffet because it's just like clean clean trash bags full of a oh, bunch yeah, no of food. Doubt. They have to throw it away, too. I was in there like, yo, I'll take that cheesecake. Like, nah. Wow, dude. That's the shit, then. Because, I mean, they do make a lot of food. Yeah. And then they have to throw it out. I'm going to start trying to save some money, dude, and it start doing re- some dumpster diving. It could be a reality. And it, it, it is, is some people's reality. And some people... I know a guy that paid off like all his student loans by doing shit like that dumpster diving dumpster diving for like a year or his two years Shane mm. no <laughs> I'm not gonna say his name Shane probably would he's probably dumpster diving right now and he doesn't even need to <laughs> it sucks that nobody knows who Shane is but Shane's uh he's an engineer they will know who Shane is you will know who Shane is all he has an engineer brain and he dumpster dives. <laughs> Any dumpster. 
He makes millions, and he dumpster dives. Yes. He dumpster dive. They call me Johnny, and I dumpster dive. Dude, when are we going to get a Judas? Judas? Hmm. Judas. A Judas has to come naturally. That's true. No, 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 no. I, I just like to complain. He's just a huge little bitch. I like yeah, I just like to complain. I like the cold. It, it um, strengthens me. It strengthens you into Rastafari. The cold is good for you. It's healthy. I still got salt and sand on on me. I take a cold shower every morning. I I do that from time to time, but then I'm like, mm, the warm ones, super nice. The warm ones are super nice, but once the you get into a zone, feel better after. Mm-hmm. The cold ones are like, Ugh. right at the ah. end there when you're trying to like wake up and just fucking make it happen. And then. And then you wake up. That's what I think it cold. does. It does for me is just like right before you're about to get out, you're like, oh, oh give it to me. Yeah. <laughs> or right when you wake up and you have like a big day, you know you got to do some shit, it's, and you just want to do the, like the first thing that you do is like you fucking walk through that door to the bathroom, like oh I'm gonna crush it. And you get in, you <laughs> turn on that cold water, and you're like oh that'll crush me. Yeah. And then you get out and you look at yourself in the mirror and you go oh I'm gonna fucking crush it today. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's a good. That's a good thing. I think like switching from those cold showers and only doing warm ones because you're like, ah, those cold ones. I mean, I just rather for it to be warm. And then you just like you get out and you're like, oh, I wish I was in that warm water. And then the day is just like, I was just not. I can't even walk anymore because I fucking went for that hot shower. Yeah, the hot shower can really be like a dampener from me getting my day started at like five thirty or six to. Me getting my day started at 11. <laughs> the warm shower just makes you go back to bed or what? Yeah, dude. And you know what's funny? My girlfriend just sent me a thing that was saying that warm showers are totally, like, Bad scientifically known to make you more tired, make you more I relaxed. Mean, you, I mean... Like heating your, your head, body, and brain. It's not meant to be warm, those showers. What do you mean? It's probably only like 100 years old, warm showers. Warm showers? Ah, uh, you think so? Well, I mean, for the ma- for the majority of people, it's probably... For most common men, yeah. yeah. Common men. True. For most common True. men. But that's a, that's a good point. You raise those cold showers. I might You might go into the bathroom and you're like, give it to me. And then mm-hmm. you can get Yeah, on. like yeah. the first thing that you're doing. And like, I feel like if you set... You set a precedent for something for the day. For the day, for the you're day. setting a precedent for every the day. day. You set like, mm-hmm. if I can take this, I can take anything, and then you set it to like five cold. Yeah. What do you do? Five, ten? Oh, I go all the way cold. Ten. Yeah. If ten's all the way. Yeah. All the way. Cold. I don't like have a number system. It's just either really cold or really hot. Cold is just the regular temperature of the water that comes into your house, I think. It doesn't get cooled down. So, like, mm, mm-hmm. in Canada, in the winter, cold was fucking mm. cold. That's the thing. Like, I'm I'm saying, like, I take cold showers. It doesn't get that fucking cold here. The yeah, coldest yeah, it yeah. gets is, like, 55 degrees. You know so, what? I'm, I'm taking gonna... a 55-degree shower sometimes. You know, most of the time, it's, like, 65. I'm going to do... Cold showers from now on. Fuck it, because it's too it's too nice. That's dope, man. It's too nice to take the warm shower. It is, man. It's and like, there's oh, so many. This is just nice. And mm-hmm. then, yeah. And then what? It's such a luxury, and it's yeah. it's cool to have, you know. But probably. Well, should, yeah. I'll enjoy that. I kind of figure that I'll enjoy cold or hot showers when I'm older more too. <laughs> so you just do cold showers? Yeah, like when I retire, I'll I'll start taking hot. Now showers. you can treat yourself. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Damn, I always do warm showers, but I also know how much of a luxury it is to take a warm shower. And I go, damn, I'm so fucking lucky. I mm-hmm. just got hot water at my disposal. Yep. For like max 10, 15 minutes, then you're an asshole, you know? Mm hmm. But yeah. I 10 always, or 15 minutes? Dude, I showers. feel like an asshole if I'm taking longer than a four minute hot shower. Really? Yeah, well, my water probably tank probably is super like small too. Oh, that's a good idea. That's, so, a, that's a good idea to maximize your, your shit. Yeah. Not much. In high school, though, did I'm you take like 20 like minute showers in high school? 
Um, you know, my dirty little pleasure in high school was dude, I'd I hop did. in the bath because we had this small uh, bathtub that you could fill up super quickly. Yeah. And I was like playing water polo or swimming and just an active kid. And so a hot bath seemed to be nice on los musculos. Yeah, I do that too. A hot bath is good. The hot tub is good. Because I have a hot tub at my apartment. And then you finish it off with a cold swim. And then it's nice. If you finish it with the hot, like, again, you're just like, no, nah, I'm all right. I don't, I don't do drugs. Yeah, you do. You did a dab <laughs> last time. This is, like, much more mild. The California cigarette. So, so, now, so now, since weed's completely legal, do we call it a drug? Because, like, alcohol's a drug, too, and no one calls it that. So is now this not a drug? Yeah, it's just weird. That's the great debate, man, and I think that's what every stoner will say is, hey, man, it's not a drug. And the it's truth is, I mean, earth. it is a drug. The air is a Everything drug. is a drug. Like, the we can't lie to ourselves. You know, everything. Coffee's a drug. Sudafed's a drug. Tylenol's a drug. Alcohol's a drug. Drugs. Drugs. Right, they're all drugs. But drugs aren't necessarily bad for you. There's no such thing as There's bad, things man. that amplify life. There's things that'll deteriorate from your life, and you can't go overboard with any of the shit. Yeah, especially the opiates, like warm showers. Frown, 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 frown. Fuck them opiates. Fuck Purdue Pharma. Shane works for one of the biggest pharma companies on the planet. Pew, pew. Does he? Doesn't he? Merck. <laughs> Doesn't he? He just said that today. Yeah, yeah. I mean, don't bring that man's. Don't bring that man into this. Shane. Shane's a good we man. I know. We shouldn't put him on blast. Because I don't know the history of Merck. Merck? Do you know Blowhole? No, no, I don't. I'm sh- I'm- <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I thought he works for a company that just like fixes Sells. software for medical Nobody knows this, places. dude. They think we're just talking about some fucking boring ass dude in the sky, Shane? dude. Fuck Shane right now. Shane is... Just kidding. Shane's a ledge. Dude, is Shane good. is a ledge, man. Dude, I was talking about paintball today, just because it comes up, because he had an airsoft gun in his car and he shot me with it, and I'm like, that doesn't hurt Shane. <laughs> he shot you with the airsoft gun today? Yeah. It, it, <laughs> didn't, it didn't really hurt that much. Hmm. Those things stink. So I took the gun and I shot him. And, and he was fine with it. And, I was, and then I'm like, oh, I used to be on, like, the city where I'm from. You guys had a paintball team? The, I, I, I got very good. The, actually, one of the teams I was friends with oh, God. went on to be number I'm one on the planet. For reals? Which one was yeah, it? I'm chilling. Team Impact. I know, that's what I'm thinking. Team Impact? <laughs> yeah, it's a long time ago. I was playing a good I was playing with them when they were just noobs. Team X-Blades. Our buddy David Cornell would know who that is. He was he on some would. like he played with they have a, he played with Shane yeah. yeah they have their own gun line and all yeah their own that's shit. sick yeah. it really is a cool sport I think the reason that it started going downhill is because it's there's expensive no, there's no focus too like when you're watching it there's no there's no like in every like successful like thing that you could watch there's like a ball to mm-hmm. watch now I in think it could, like everybody I feel like it could get more popular now because uh, cameras have come such a long way and you could focus more on a per player basis that's but true but the, the, it would still be hard you'd have to have like a three-man team or something the level, where you could focus more on it the level of adrenaline and like the lack of like it's not like in a real gunfight when you get hit it's like ah, and blood goes everywhere but in paintball it's like, so like we should <laughs> honestly just start doing it with real guns and just that might be. That might take off. We could get some bums to do it. <laughs> that was a thing. Do you guys remember bum, bumfights.com? I do remember that. I I think those guys got the fuck we suit out of them. So really, back it's in not the a day. thing anymore. I figured that was for sure still Dude, getting wait, videos uploaded every day. Wait, no, 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 no. That 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 was like back. That's like some shit. Like the fucking the dark dawn, web. At the dawn of the internet, we the were all... The dawn of the like internet was going Michael, crazy. We were all Michael animals. Vick. We were all animals. For reals, dude. There was some gnarly shit going around. And we were all like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dead people. Yeah. Kill. I didn't watch America. that shit. No, Stuff I didn't. That made me feel sad. Really? Oh, yeah, yeah, you know what? I avoided really? a lot of shit, too. But I, there was every once in a while where you had that fucking fuck. moron friend that would, like... You just couldn't get out of seeing something. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like you guys, 
You send me like the weirdest shit. I don't send you. I've weird never shit. seen anyone get killed on the internet. Maybe you like haven't? maybe like four now by I've accident. seen a bunch of shit. Maybe like four. Four by. Did accident. you see Blowhole's pretzel shit that he sent in the group message uh, two days ago? No, it was a full pretzel. <laughs> it went. That thing was disgusting. Was it a person? No, I shat. Oh, <laughs> nice. Very good. Very, very nice, Blowhole. Very nice. Yeah. That's very, very I'm going to nice. check the camera here. You want to see the picture? Dude, no, but you. one dead person video that I saw was when my brother was playing soccer in New York. One of his buddies was walking down the street, and this guy fucking jumped off a building and landed, like, on some f- bicycles right next to him. And oh so he pulled out his camera, God. and he took a video of the after a math, and he was right there with his mom. His mom saw the whole thing. They got some, like, blood on him. Oh. And, uh... Yeah, dude, it was like gnarly. pretty gnarly. You could not really oh, identify yeah. where this guy's head or ass was. You know, it just looked like a blob. That's all. Or what, like, what his clothes looked like. He, this just guy was just. Could you imagine being the person who saw that? The rest of their day, like, is that guy completely unrelated? Or, I mean, I think it's a it's a trippy experience, but with uh, with counseling people can get over a lot of shit that's crazy it's crazy how people like react to certain levels of what what happens like i worked at a liquor store when i was Mm -hmm. a young lad in school Mm -hmm. and i got robbed just some guy like with (laughs) with a mask came in and like like took a bunch of vodka and stuff and ran out and i'm like I don't even think I told anyone. I just continued doing my shift. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) I'm like, "Ah, I don't care that much. And I wasn't shaking or anything. Yeah. I was just like, ah, that's not my, I don't care about that. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, That's not my fucking battle. He, he rushed in and got that vodka. Did he have a gun and did he point it at you? No. Well, that's the difference right there. Yeah. That's one difference I'd say. That's a big difference. If somebody threatens to end your life, that's like a level of, what is that stress hormone? Cortisol and, and adrenaline. That's just going to hit your body. Oh, like yeah. did you have no control over probably. Yeah, no, I've never really been close to death. I've been close to death, but not because of somebody trying to like kill me. Yeah. I think I was maybe one time, but it was my own doing and I didn't realize that I was. I was bleeding internally. Oh, shit. And just oh. turning white, and somebody said, like, hey, man, you're turning white. <laughs> and I was like, oh, fuck, maybe I should go to the hospital. Why were you bleeding internally? Um, I had went off a bicycle jump as a wee lad, probably about <laughs> fifth or sixth grade. A little mini Colton just and sending it off a bike jump. Just sending it, and took the handlebars to the gut, thought I knocked the wind out of me. Ooh. Turned out I God. severed the old spleen. Hmm. Which turns out you don't necessarily need that organ. Oh, so it's an educational. You can get on without your spleen, but you don't want to be bleeding. You don't want to be bleeding, but you have. I think you have to take medicine because your spleen deals with white blood cells. You'll probably die quite a bit earlier because you get sick more often if you don't have your spleen. But you could still somehow manage. But so I got super lucky. I got super lucky that I... Now you know all about the spleen. I kept my spleen. <laughs> I got to keep it. <laughs> and now you know about the spleen. And now you know about the spleen. That was God teaching yeah. you about the spleen. <laughs> that was God telling me to chill the fuck. Hey, dude, slow the fuck. Damn. Hey. Internal bleeding. Colton, I need... I'm going to give you a big lesson to... Now you're going to know everything there is to know about the spleen. No, shout out to my mom, <laughs> though, because she was the one that came in. She told me to take a bath. She was like, go take a bath. You probably just, like, knock the wind out of yourself hurt your rib and then I went and laid in bed and she came in and she her eyes were big and I was like what she's like we need to go to the hospital you're turning white oh like ah mama huevon pinche pendejo puta madre no mama huevon no pinche cabron no mames huevon so I spent a week in the hospital that was dope a for week? a fucking ADHD kid sitting in a hospital bed, just wanted to fucking do something. A week, yeah. and then two well, weeks at home in games? bed. Did they have any games at the hospital? Yeah, I was playing uh, that one game, like, with the gorilla jumping around. Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong. Class. Did you have control of your bowel movements? Did you just piss yourself for, like, a week? 
I was pissing and shitting like normal, but I couldn't get up to piss or shit. Oh, you know yeah, what I'm the saying? The spleen doesn't have. Because at this time they didn't well, have. He just like they didn't have me all jacked up on. Hard, probably fucked. They didn't have me up. jacked up on opiates at this point because this is like pre opiate get people addicted. That's right because you broke your neck, right, or your back. I broke my ankle. Is when in like junior year of high school so around 2006 2007 when they were like you get an opiate you get an opiate you get a fat prescription yeah everybody uh-huh so everybody if i get in so what's yeah a, what's an opiate then vicodin norco percocet oxycontin never had any of those that's it's in all so the, good you know all the rap music it's in all the rap all those freaking rappers are Drinking it and perka, perka. eating it. And perka, perka, perka. I think it's you just a made a hook live, line man. when you said all of those together. What's that? that? You said Vicodin. Oh, yeah. Norco. Percocet. That is. You just rattled four of them off really quick. You just put that on a loop and put a beat Oxy to it. Oxycontin, Percocet, <laughs> Lord Tibbs, and Verzit. Yeah, that, that is a rap song, actually, from right? Lil White is his name, I believe. Lil White. Dude, it's sad. Like Little with Wyatt. even Mac Miller, you know, like Mac Miller. Oh, just McKenzie. rest in peace, pal. Mackenzie Milton. Dude. Mackenzie Milton. Mac, Mac Milton. Mac. The kids Mac. are getting that Mac. old, Mac. that this old dirty song. stuff. Like he just put this out. This is cool, actually. Hey, speaking, uh, are you gonna put this on YouTube? You can leave it. You're saying it to yeah. Level? I think that, that that's where we should start doing it is like adding it to YouTube once every week. It's on YouTube, fool. It's, it's on YouTube? Yeah. Oh, yeah, shit, man. It's already there. Oh, dude, cork me then. Call me Corky Samuels. This is what? This is Mackenzie well, Milton? It's only the first hour, though. He's got a... Dude, we should do a live stream sometime. This is Mackenzie Milton right now? Yeah, man. This is not bad. I like this. It's Thundercat on the bass. He really is a dope musician, man, and he rolled with dope musicians, too. Yeah, it sounds like it. Yeah, he could play John, the piano like John Mayer recorded on yeah. like a on one of his songs on the new album. Mm-hmm. That's him. Mm-hmm. He's all right. Yeah, dude. He's all right. He's been all right. He's all right. He's been all right. And now he's dead. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. So right now, a dead person is singing to us. That, he lives forever. Yeah. forever. Constantly. Because there's so many downloads. That's the cool thing about art is that even after you're gone, it lasts forever. Ish. Depends. For a long time. Usually there's like a purge every 2,000 years of art and everything. Yeah. Art's been around for maybe like 6,000 years. Yeah, if the left. 5,000. The left years. gets their way and they burn everything. If the left gets it, yeah. that's the freaking <laughs> biggest problem right now is the left. Those commies, yeah. communists. Those commies. They're going to get into power. And then fun fun everything. fact for y'all guys. Yeah. For y'all. Y'all guys. Y'all guys. Is, um, it doesn't say featuring John Mayer on this track, but John Mayer recorded the guitars on this. That's sick. That's, that's, that's sick that's that it doesn't up. say it. I like when that happens, when there are no titles, no... Yeah. Because John Mayer's isn't like, oh, I'm not going to do it unless I can get up. No, he's like... You know, that's cool. I'll he's like, that, yeah, I'll roll through. Don't worry about it, whatever. Yeah. Why you always at the mall? When you're broke. People should do stuff because they want to do things. Yeah. Uh. And I just want to It doesn't even really sound like he's playing though, which is interesting. You know, he like played to playing, the track. Yeah, is he playing like the? Hear the chords in the back? They're all uh-huh. distorted. I probably need to do better. Fuck whoever. Keep my shit together. You never told me being rich was so lonely. Nobody know me. Oh well, hard to complain from this five-star hotel. I'm always in a rush. I've been thinking too much, but keep it on the hush. No one need to know, just us. That's really all it takes. We don't need nothing I mean, but two. It's a bummer, dude. He was a sad guy. It seems I mean, like. I mean, he could have just. The world is so actually, small. Actually, if he was being 
truthful and legit, I'm building up a if he felt this way, you can give it all away and move to fucking she hate it when I call Africa. And it's like, and it's yeah, but... I don't want to keep you waiting. How feasible is that, honestly? Like, Very statistically, you, you how many people he, do that? He, I can think of he one. Enough, he had enough money. I of mean, course, but I can think of one famous person that actually got away for a while. Right, can you well, think of who I'm thinking of? Dave Chappelle. Yeah. He went to Africa. Yeah. But, like, just even taking that journey of going away and stepping out of the limelight he for a while. He did it. He, he survived. He, he, he is a very, very smart... He's, like tapped in more than most people, you know? Yeah. Dave Chappelle's legit. I feel, I, like, think, I feel like ending it, though, like, you can... I mean, I think that's a bigger step than mm-hmm. going to Africa. Or, like, China. The prob- I think one of the things with Mac Miller is... I don't know. He got don't famous know. at, like, 17, I want to say, or 18. Oh, wow. Yeah. And McKenzie I think that's Milton. a tough age to be to have a lot handed to you. That's true. I guess you really wouldn't know what the possibilities were outside of mm-hmm. whatever it was. Who knows? I think Dave Chappelle was maybe like 22, 23 before he got he, his yeah, show. Yeah, yeah. He, he, I think and he, then he saw which way it was going. He saw which way the the industry was trying to push him and he said, fuck this, I'm going to go and do my thing for a while. He said, I'm rich, bitch. I don't have to <laughs> fucking listen Rick to what James, you guys say. bitch. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Dave yeah. Chappelle seems like a really so, cool dude. If you're thinking about, if you're rich mm-hmm. and successful and famous, and you want to kill yourself, you can just give it all away and then get out. And then, no, like, there's places in the world that no one. But will the know thing you. is, yeah, maybe, but where? Fucking like the forest, man. Go to the forest. You think the bears know who you are? Alaskan bush people. You who seen wants the show? To go live in, but humans are tribal people. I who feel wants like to live I in would, the fucking forest. I feel like it, I could live in the forest for a couple you years. You maybe, but you're a psycho. Rick James, bitch. <laughs> 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 but I mean, live there for a month and then you'll get perspective and then you'll come back and you'll be like, I see clearly. Totally, man. The and rain I don't gone. think that he did it on purpose. I think Probably that he not. just took yeah. a little too much and he might have been like, you know what? For all we know, he could have been like, this is, I'm getting clean next week. You know, I'm just going to yeah. go hard this week. I could have died yesterday when I took you know? five Tylenols. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of Tylenols. <laughs> My throat uh, yesterday hurt so much that I was like, man, I got to take like five Tylenols. Dude, this guy's got, he's sick or something. I don't know what's up. Yeah, my throat hurts a lot. I haven't eaten for like two days. I had that cheeseburger, but it slid down. because You got to, have you been drinking a lot lately? Just, <laughs> this, just is, like, this is now your AA council. Yeah, yeah. Just, uh, you know, like mm, every just your day. standard average average. For me, honestly, no, if, I, if I drink for yeah. like a few days in a row, I'll notice that like my tonsils will get swollen. No, I don't. I and don't, I'm smoking I hooch. I don't drink at home. I just drink out. So I don't do that much it anymore. Just drinks with the boys. Yeah. Well, that's good. I'm trying to, trying to deduce what this could be. Did you ever have the I body think I'm aches? Just getting sick. He's getting yeah. sick, but the difference sick. is, is if I was that sick right now, I would be miserable. Like he just was like, he yeah, just I'm playing spike ball. We're doing this podcast. You would never know, but he said it when he He's swallows a heart. Here's the thing: food. It sounds like feels like glass. I would like growing up. I would always be like anyone who was afraid of getting sick. I would be like, what? What? What are you afraid of getting sick for? Like, what the fuck? I would I would never, yeah. like, think of that. And I'm like, people who are legitimately, like, stay away from me. Like, that's just fucking, who cares? Yeah. Well, I do. Well, I, I'm not going to, like, miserable. I'm not going to share a drink with you. That's for sure. But yeah. No, this. I'm not going to not get in a high vehicle five. with you. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably about where, if it was, like, a long drive, though, and you were, like, vomiting or coughing really mucho, I wouldn't want to go in a car with you. Yeah, like but I, I'd sick, go to lunch a, with you outside. But that actually gets me. Like if you had a cold, that's one thing. It but gets me in trouble. I'd, like go, I'd go eat the but, shit out of lunch with you. When winter starts, as a Canadian, when, mm-hmm. when, when winter starts, you usually like get sick like once a year at least. Is that when you guys start taking your elderberry? That's, <laughs> that's when we hide away in the igloos. Yeah, that's, how, that's when we go in our igloos. Away in the we, igloos start, yeah. we start building right away. <laughs> Got to get that fucking snow ready. <laughs> Gotta get that pack. Yo, get dude, that nice fucking snow pack. On? It's just like oh, that bitch ass. 
Oh, there's definitely uh But uh yeah, no, we'd we'd get sick cuz when winter comes it's like ah. Yeah, and I'm going to hit this video real quick every year. Check it out. Hit it, son. Spin that dial. Oh, yeah. Damn, man. Still Mega going. Mega style. It was 20 minutes last time. What is it now? Yeah, I guess that's right. Because <sighs> we should probably cut it an hour, I think. 14.35. Oh. See? Last time was crazy. Like, last time we did six hours. I know. And now, like, this has been like, oh, that's, did you hit this, both is good of them? this is a good time. You might have just hit the wrong one. Yeah, no, we get sick a lot in Canada, but here, here, it's not as common. So maybe like my mentality about sickness is like, well, you're gonna get fucking sick anyway. You guys get sick a lot in Canada. You're saying? I feel like because of the winter, everyone. Yeah, you know why I think part of that is, is because everybody's indoors more often, and so that's probably true. Germs can get transferred easier, and a lot of those viruses and bacteria are airborne illnesses. Mm. That's probably why. Dropping knowledge, go to college. But who knows? Colton's back in college. Back in the collage, making collage. I realize that college now, as a 28 year old, is just a place where you can go and like people will tell you, like, oh, way to go. You can complete tasks and you pay for it. But for some reason in the real world, like people respect that and they'll like want to give you more money at the end if you figure it out. I, th- yeah. I think that's changing though It is changing say, but It depends it's, what industry now too Yeah For you guys For artists It's not that big a deal No It can be But but it's not And I think it is changing I think education is going to Yeah completely. If you can weasel your way Into an ad agency It doesn't matter But most <laughs> of the ad agencies That I want to work for I know their create. No, I don't know their creative directors I know a couple creative directors And I know of other creative directors and they all have degrees in something. So that bird is loud. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody shut that bird up. Somebody shut that fucking baby up. Yeah. Like yeah. 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 But it's definitely not necessary, especially in what you're doing or what I'm doing. If you have a, a portfolio to to show that you can complete shit, they don't care. Yeah. Yes. <clears throat> it depends. Yeah. The whole world is changing before our eyes. Yeah. Before you know it, there will be artificial intelligence it's running around. Us. You will know what is real and what is not real. And you won't know how long it's been happening for. Bless me. It's amazing how much control one person can have though in on the on the planet you can you can pretty much do whatever you want if you have yeah, money, for sure. money, money money you gotta have money 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 money, 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 money. <laughs> you gotta tap in tap in all the money bags tap in tap in just think about that well blow's about to have um unlimited fun tickets here pretty soon that means we're gonna be rich soon everybody's gonna be rich how's blow he's gonna have a record label are you starting your own record label? No. Not yet. I think what it will be is... You'll be the producer. Not a record label. It's going to be something else. Like, it's the future. So it's the future. It's yeah, it's else. a collective uh, of sorts. Kind of. Yeah. It is. A collective, I don't, like, I don't, collectively... I don't like to ever, like, come across... Pretentious. Like, communist. And collective sounds, it's close. Collective does sound a bit yeah, commie, doesn't it? Yeah, he's the top it? dog. He's the big boy of the operation. I like, I like the copy like that collective idea, like a group, but mm-hmm. also we, no, collective more so like as services is what I was thinking. Uh, like maybe more than just recording, it's also vitiogs. Yeah, yeah, but I'm just gonna like record and shoot cool people and then. Uh, and then that's it. Dope. See what yeah. happens. Let's see what happens. <laughs> see what happens. I don't. I don't think I would want to own anything. I would just want to be able to use it, and then eventually I would probably record and shoot a lot of cool people that it would be known that I did that, and then that's it. Cool. And then that's that's that. It's sun. Pew pew. Jeez, that spike ball session got got me tired, but the. But the beers 
<laughs> got me even more tired. In that <laughs> warm shower. In that warm shower. To, uh, didn't well, uh, what do you say we get some food here coming up? Uh, Should we open this Ooh. year? Uh, this can next order? break, huh? Nobody can leave until we order a pizza. I think what we do you know. Fuck card. that, dude. We what do you say we all go freaking put this thing on pause and go get a couple Cali Burt's, dude? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, my, my throat hurts. I, I can't really eat that much. Dude, it, daddy's, what I'm saying. daddy's getting hungry. Sick. See, dude, you we gotta, need to... You got to suffer it out for we the gotta, next 40 minutes. Your vibes are low, though, dude. Yeah. Your vibes aren't the same as it's they were. You're not sticking a microphone down your throat and walking around <laughs> with a dildo up your dinker. It's up and, it's up and down world, man. This is episode two. You never know is what you, you know. Episode two, saying, but, episode two blowhole was sick. Yeah. That's the title. And Trav was hung over. Trav was hung over. Colton feels like a million bucks, but he wants to go out. And yeah, you were dropping freaking. knowledge. You were telling us about mm-hmm. things that... You're welcome. Blowhole didn't know about you. You're welcome. Blowhole, here, why don't you just use my teeth? <laughs> I know. Long he was like Mike. slamming these things on the railing. And I'm like, dude, like, I don't know if Rosie built this or what, but she doesn't need to have bottle teeth. Sorry, Rosie. On the Rosie is a real nice lady. She runs this fucking tight ship. She runs this ship. Well, what do you say we go get some foods? No, we have to continue for the fans. How long have we been going for? <laughs> we have to continue. For our 16 homies. For the fans. <laughs> for the fans. These are for the future fans. The for the future fans, future fans, yeah. yeah. Fans. Right now we got 16. We need to have a One segment. day we'll have 16 million. Maybe we'll have like two no. that we'll watch up to this point. Not that many, but we need to have a segment. Like two million one day would just be nice. No, vocabulary like with two. Colton. Vocabulary with Colton. Vocabulary with Brent. Today's word of the day. Spike ball. From Colton and the Mongoloids. Vocabulary with Judge Matumba. That's like my great great grandpa's name. Let's, He's just Choctaw Judge. Let's talk about the Kerbal Space Program. Kerbal? What the fuck is Kerbal? That's the video game I'm currently playing. <laughs> it's amazing. There's like the video games suck. Basically, it's like next question. It's like uh, it's not the same names, but we got Mercury, we got Venus, we got Mars, we got Earth, we got fucking. Oh, that sounds groovy. No, man. Mars is after. So Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars. What's after Mars? Jupiter? No. Jupiter, Uranus. I know all of them Pluto. in the order from the, no, no, no. From the sun. Saturn. Saturn is after. And then the sun is right on the outside and everything. Yeah. <laughs> the world sun is circles flat. around everything, right? Yeah, the sun <laughs> circles. Anyways, this game yeah, man. is insane. You can go to all the planets. You can build... All everything you can build, plant. Wow, it sounds like you're being God. <laughs> Goddamn. <laughs> Kerbal Space Program. <laughs> this is this is Gene. Oh, we're allowed to play this. Then. Gene Navarro Jr. Uh, Gene Navarro. Is this Gene Navarro? This is. Uh, we're going to be working with him on, <laughs> on the, the Joshua Tree. Yeah. So he's doing all the sound. Oh, okay. That day. He's not playing. I don't. He he might. He probably will. No, he. I don't. I have no idea. Oh. So, are they trying to get this thing on sex clicks? I have no idea. Cause like, the desert's funny because in the desert it's like, like Pappy and Harriet's. Mm-hmm. Like, like Paul McCartney could be there. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. The desert's just. I, I'm trying to say is anything can happen in the desert. Cool. I mean, well, here's the thing. If Gene Navarro Jr. is not playing. It means that they've got some pretty legit people. They playing. do. It's a, it's like a it's like a documentary esque. I don't know on the desert scene, which is an interesting. Like Joshua Tree is a very interesting place. Music scene and the property where the studio is is like very legit. It's like a mile dirt road to this place, mm-hmm. and it's like there's Joshua Trees. Very sick. And that's it. <laughs> that's about it. There's sand. We're filming a concert for people that are listening to us. If there's anybody and saying, what the fuck are these idiots talking about? We're filming a concert and something about somebody said Netflix. Maybe the production company are working with Netflix That guy's a Canadian. Or something. Is he? Yeah. I knew he was a fucking weirdo. Yeah. Those, there's no more. Probably gets high on six Tylenols. Yeah. <laughs> that's what we do. 
It's like, oh, it's pretty cold outside there. Here's six Tylenols. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking it's help pretty you. cold outside there, pal. Why don't you take these uh, six uh, acetaminophenes and just fucking just brave it out there <laughs> you don't even need a coat just fucking six tylenols just send it with six tylenols there brother <laughs> oh you need to walk to the bus station oh, six tylenols i gotta walk all the way to ottawa brother <laughs> can i borrow like 25 bottles of tylenols <laughs> you gotta walk to ottawa here's some skates you could probably skate half the way you could skate half the way yeah on some ice you could use some ice skates here's your six here's your 20 bottles of tylenol in your ice skates. <laughs> Get to Ottawa, yeah. you stupid son of a bitch. Yeah, from Boston, I guess. Yeah, I think I went Bostonian on that last little but part. But you could probably skate from Boston to Ottawa, maybe. Yeah, I don't know, man. I think those skates would be pretty smelly by the end. You'd have some fat-ass blisters. You had some fat-ass blisters. Fat I can't believe we did six those hours last time. Fat ass. I know. Well... I think we gotta we gotta phone somebody. All right, switch it up. Que es el tiempo de la cámara? It's a uh, almost phone seven Shane. o'clock. We've been talking about Six Shane. Five. Five. Phone Shane. Phone him up. He's he's playing it like soccer or oh softball. Uh, softball. He's got a softball. Still game. rolling. Crank that ISO, bro. <laughs> uh, it's the wheel. The wheel is the ISO. I have. The wheel makes the ISO go up and down. The, you use it at like 5,000? Oh, yeah, whatever. Who cares? Dude, God, that's so incredible. What about like 16,000? Sure. Why not? Really? Really? Wait, really? Shit. Sure, why Why not? Sony, what was I doing? Sony A7 III is really a good oh, camera. Oh, chain. I'm pretty stoked to see what the Sony A7 S3. Not uh, who cares about cameras though. Are you, uh, are you gonna use the, um, oh, he's taking a pee. Huh. I I can't hear you. Are you gonna buy the S3? Uh, probably. Probably. But like, I was afraid of. I was afraid of like having this like because I just have like a two hundred dollar lens or whatever like the kit lens that came with it and I'm like oh that's not gonna be good enough and it just doesn't do like some of the stuff that I want and and blah 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 but yeah fuck fuck it dude I'm just stoked to use the A7 III and the fact that I think by the time I'm gonna end up buying it it's probably gonna be around fifteen hundred bucks used for that's just the body stupidly good for what you get. Yeah, I'm just going to keep renting it for a few more gigs that I've got. We got Shane. Your no. call has been oh. automatic- Yeah, he's on tour. He's not fucking answering. Oh, he's probably playing right now. Well, he's up by Canada, isn't he? <laughs> oh, what the fuck? He's actually by Ottawa. Hey, the band that he's on tour with is called Electric Voodoo. I couldn't think of the name last time, but I was like, I should have said said the name should have figured it out um yeah he's on tour i think shane's gonna be playing mm-hmm. playing ball all right well we don't have anyone to call <laughs> so we don't have anybody to call it's just the three of us tonight dude just, just really the three of us trying to figure it out we can we make it if we try just the three of us you just and the three I. of us just a few <laughs> Damn. All right, so when are we going to go get some burritos, boys? Today's hot topic is burritos. Burritos. What kind of burrito are you going to get, Colton? I think I'm going to get a carne asada burrito. I like Shut the... Up. I think I like I'm going to get a carne asada. Where are we going to go get these burritos? So... So adobada, how do you say this? Adobada. Right? Yeah, that's what I say. But some people go adobada. Adobada. Dude, I mean, have you noticed adobada. the variation of people trying to speak Spanish in California, though? It's either yeah. like white people try to speak it or they just don't. And they're in like, Canada, it. they had like a a burrito in a in a restaurant or my friend took a picture of it and it, they, 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 they It was a burrito in a bowl? They in Canada. They uh they spelt it with a V, like A, A V. 
Oh, bah. I think that's avocado? like Ruka. A V O. You were about to spell R V C A. No, uh, they because it's like they go avobada or whatever. Avobada. They probably just misinterpreted. Hello. Maybe, hello. maybe maybe that's like some. I can see that being some Spain Spanish, Spanish. but I don't. Spanish. Maybe. They speak Spanish in Spain. Some uh, Spain Spanish. I don't know, brother. That's that crazy. sounds like some funky fucked up shit to me. It is friggin' funky. I think that they were just trying to be slick because. A V looks cooler than a U, which is why companies use it, like Ruka. Yeah, but it's not a U, it's a D. You said V. Yeah, they have a V. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so confused, dude. You said U. I'm tapping out. He said D. Yeah, but it's They have a D. V. I want a quesadilla. I'll tell you how that's spelled. From where, though? A I'm large horchata and a chicken quesadilla. Ooh, son. Dude, I want to freaking jam on some old tunes one of these days. Some old tunes. You got to find those old tracks. Oh, you guys were in a Dude, band. I was jamming on a couple of them the other day. I like remember you know the chord progressions. And, uh, oh, um, shit. That no, no. Me. I just remember I, I some am, of them. I am going to take Courtney's ukulele. Oh, yeah. yeah. Did she say you could? Yeah, she did. No, he's going to steal it I like just, a thug. I don't care. Her boyfriend way. has like really nice eyes and nice teeth. That's really gay. <laughs> <laughs> but I came in the room and I looked at him and he looked at me and I'm like, he's got nice eyes and nice teeth. Chicks dig that. <laughs> yeah, apparently. Yeah, yeah. The he's a cool dude. He rips too. Guys I saw him catch the biggest waves at Calafia. Or, uh, I I know. That looks sick. I dude, wish he, I could rip. I he, wish I was there. Yeah, he got the waves of the day. Uh, definitely. It was like 18 feet, maybe faces, I saw maybe 17 those foot, videos. 15 foot, I don't know, somewhere around there. You got to see it, Blowhole, it's insane. Uh, I would really like to attempt that stuff. Yeah, you would, except it's super shallow, like rock oh, reef can you hurt over yourself? there. Oh, fuck, yeah. So what, what, so what do you do to not die? You just try to not die. Starfish out. Yeah. Starfish? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> or like try and just pop out I'll, before you I'll get slammed. I'll think of that when I'm like on a f- 18 foot wave, just starfish. But honestly, you want to try it. You want to try and cork out before you get. Just try to nuked. swim through the but other side. Here's the thing: is like I, I always like everyone talks about how shallow the water is, and like D Street, the water is fucking shallow. Like when I heard, yeah. when I got cut up by my fin, my board was hitting the sand, and I would never know it was that shallow. Yeah. Because you're surfing, and you barely, and you're always star fishing and stuff. And when you fall, you don't like just go to the bottom. Mm-hmm. Sometimes yeah. you kick off the bottom, but it's it's shocking how shallow you're surfing in. I mean, just like mm. bottom line, protect your head at the end yeah. of the day. Yeah. <coughs> I've just started to relax now. Yeah. It's like, um, Jesus Dude, will look guide at this wave. me through this wave. I think that's it. Yeah. Uh, oh, look at that thing. oh, if you could edit that over this video, that would be insane. I don't think I'll put in the time yet. To do yeah, that. that's a <laughs> lot. That's very true. Could I see that though? Is that the one of Milano? That's yeah. it, dude. Such a fucking sick. That's way. Judas's job. Yeah, that's Oops. why we need a Judas. Judas, if you're out there in the oh, barrel dude, section, barrel. Right there, huh? Too bad that palm tree is in the way. Do we want to bring up again? Do we want to bring up this? Let me see it again. Let me see it again. Do we want to bring up this this surfer crossing sign? Do we want to bring that up? So sick. What are you talking about? This surfer crossing sign right here. It's so cool. You like it? Yeah. Surfer crossing. As soon as I came here for the first time, I'm like, oh man, Travis is cool. He's there's surfer crossing here. Dude, you know what? I I had mentioned that earlier. I don't like that thing. It makes me feel like a doucher. Cause I think because I had one as a little kid that my mom put in my room. It well, just guess seems what? like a little Fool, try hard, you don't but you know what? I don't. Here, and a chick also lives here. And so she it, surfs. It gives Dude, you yeah, well, but you're a pussy, so... You Whatever. think I bought that thing? You think I'm if I had kidding, an extra dude. 25 bucks that I would have go to the store and buy that All I'm sign? saying is if I if I was the set designer Yo, here, listen, I'd fool. say you, think you guys I bought that shit? look like little bitches. That was there already when we moved I know here. it was. Oh, That's no. why I, it was there already, so I don't, it's whatever. Yeah, you have to keep it. Why? You got to keep it. It was, was the, there once, it's was there the, forever. Was the, was the 420 there too? Uh, I don't know, but I noticed in the yeah. last one it wasn't. It was. The 420. Was it? Was it? It looked cropped out. I just saw like a, 
I didn't 20, but I maybe didn't, I was jaw tripping. I didn't do anything. I didn't touch. The four was cut anything. in half. I the only, four was in, in... So you can't really tell. Media. media. There's not going to be any edits. Media. From here on out, the only edit is because I was like, I had my credit card number on the... That shit was funny because yeah. you were like blacked out. I yeah. The next morning <clears throat> after that first podcast, I was like, what did we do? <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. I, Do you think it it's like, going to be like that again? It was like I went, no. One day. You're not too trashed? Oh, Dude. definitely, yeah, in the future, for sure. Yeah. I'll go uh, insano. But yeah. sometimes <laughs> it's going to be a little chill. We'll talk about people getting attacked by sharks and dying on the internet and stuff. And, mm-hmm. yeah. and, and then other times... Other times we'll just be jaw yeah. But it's all about consistency. We're just doing it. To be consistent. You guys should try this uh, Corona Premiere. I've had one of Porque? those. I think from you, actually. Porque. 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 Porque es más mejor. Porque is why, right? Why is it better? Porque is why or because. Okay, so it's like 90 calories. And it says like it's smooth. And you know how Corona is, is skunky? Yeah. Okay. A little bit? Yeah. It's a little bit more smooth, actually. Okay. It's It's not bad. Corona does kind of smell well, like... Well, shit, son, pass me bit. one. It's, there's one right there. And you guys aren't fat, so you guys don't care, but it's only 90 calories for the rest of us. That's it, pretty bank house. Definitely for the I'm person... I'm kind of fat. I got to think about that shit. For the person who has enough time to listen to this, Speaking they're probably of that, fat. Colton's not fat. He just got fat ankles. I just got fat ankles. We got to go get some food soon. I got to feed these fucking ankles, bro. All right. All right. Well, we're at 56 minutes. We can... We can do another four. <laughs> <laughs> he's already doing it. And he's going to be like, point, you know what? We need to at least point, put in another 15. What does matter, dude? <laughs> I mean, you only uploaded What does it matter? Right? What does it matter right? at this point, baby? Tell right? me right now. Right? What does it matter? Right now, there's a trucker in Idaho who stumbled onto this podcast, and he's got four minutes to the next rest stop. And he's like, <laughs> why the fuck are oh, they trying to leave me matter? right now? He wants, I do not want them Do we want to, like, make him change the station? I want to make him stay, and I want to make <laughs> him listen. He'll stay. No, he'll stay, because he's got to get to the... And I will to the, to talk the, to you, baby. <laughs> I will be the man that gives you everything that daddy thinks that you need, buddy, baby. Buddy, buddy, buddy. buddy. <laughs> Let me tell you this, buddy. Let me buddy. tell you, buddy. Yeah. Hello, buddy, buddy, buddy. Let me tell you one fucking thing, <laughs> baby. If you come to me one more fucking time, I will kick you in the head. I will kick your dog and I will fuck you in the face, baby, okay? That was insane. That was, that was a little insane. That was one of the first, it, that was one of the first the viral things wasn't it right yeah you she come to my house and she kicked my, my dog, dog. Yeah. she kicked my dog yeah dude that was one of the first viral things yeah wow everybody caught that virus if yeah. you were like history a lesson. 90s baby i was <laughs> i was one of them come to my house Everybody, Your doctor, she come to my house and she kicked my dog. Everybody who she what? She kicked my dog. <laughs> um, I don't. Was it a woman on the other end or was it a man? I don't remember. I don't remember either. I think it was a dude. I don't, I don't know. Your daughter, you could play. She come to my house and she kicked my dog. That's she kicked my dog. I wonder if that that guy definitely knows. My name is Karpal. The guy. What Karpal? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Her name. My name is Karpal. What? Karpal. Your daughter, she come to my house and she kick my dog. Here you go. Here we go. We're going to do this. Going to do this to finish off the second podcast. <laughs> uh, uh, if you're... Hello, what's up, there? Aptar. Aptar. Taxi speaking, please. This is Karpal. <laughs> Karpal. Okay, one minute, please. Turn it up, turn it up. That's as loud as you can. I'll turn it up, whatever. I won't turn it up. <laughs> can you turn Hello? it up? Hello? Hi. Turn it up on I the was picture. just calling because I live down the street from you and your daughter come to my house today and she kicked my dog. Pardon? Your daughter come to my house today uh-huh. and she come on my property and then she kicked my dog. And now my dog needs operation. <laughs> she kicked your She kicked my dog. She kicked your dog? Yes. Which daughter? 
Ba-da-da-ba-da. Da-da-da-da.